My favorite time of day, locals time, baby, let's go. I set up my life in the most beautiful way possible. I get paid to play Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's go, baby, we go to locals every day. Today's locals, you already know what it is. Pendulum versus the world. I'm excited, let's get it. Oh shit, a wild jack, what's up? You shall not pass. Yeah? What's the secret password? What's the secret password? The secret password is Pemba's deck. Fuck. Oh my god, the Cyber Dragon God, please let us win today. Please play any other deck. Yo, Jack, you already know the deal. You're winning today again, right? What? Oh, Jinsuk's here. Oh, you said no chance, Jack. Jinsuk, <laughs> Jinsuk, Jinsuk. All right, boys, we're ready. Today's going to be the last locals we're going to use. Sword Soul D. And I'm going to get my revenge on you. Are you going to clap everyone up today? What are you going to do, man? Are you going to make Jinsuk eat his own words? Jinsuk just said he's going to 3-0 you in the best of one. Uh, in the best of one? That's what he said. I don't, know, like, I don't know if I can beat that. Beat that. <laughs> it doesn't get much better than Friends and Yu-Gi-Oh. Friends and Yu-Gi-Oh is the most fun you can ever have. Wait a sec, unless you're playing Friends and Dragons, the new greatest game after Yu-Gi-Oh, which you guys gotta go check out right now, down in the description below. This super awesome game with heroes. Look at that. You think you can destroy me and my team? Not today, pal. Not today. Nostalgia similar to fire emblem turn-based strategy game and this is where you could choose all your heroes i like dorian look at this guy like rhoda baby a warrior just like the pen god this is your guild hall where you could play together with friends get improved rewards and have a much better time so check out the guild hall get a guild with your buddies and start your adventure so make sure to go download friends and dragons down in the description below first link oh you think it beat me and my team not today silly dragon now with my heroes let's go so be like the pen god and sign up down below for some good times with some friends and dragons he literally looks like me and it's free so download now yo it's okay you're such a humble guy just say it you're gonna 2-0 everyone I'll, I'll try. okay let's go let's go but but could, could you tell the world are you playing the cyber dragons today Yes, I am. Oh, let's go. We're in trouble, baby. Yo, bro, you winning today? You winning today? I'm only gonna come win against you. Oh no! So you're gonna you're gonna whoop everyone. I got a secret attack. You're gonna destroy everyone? Well, Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. I Jin suck. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna win tonight. How about that? Thank you. Let's go. Let's I'm go. Win, yeah, what a chat. Jin sucks out here playing Glad Beast, bro. All I need is all I need is this three. Yeah, oh, 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 just those three? Those three and I OTK. Okay, so if we play in tournament, I'll let you open them, okay? <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, you know, um, you sniff. You... Fuck. Ring your ass. Ah, uh, something. What? Something. Something, sniff something. <laughs> You're not ready to play? Yeah, I'm done, buddy. Are you gonna, you're gonna win? I am. I can't let him win after that. Local time, baby, let's go! I might be a little hungover, but it don't matter. You wanna know why? Because the only thing that's gonna be hungover is my opponent. When I hang over, 17 negates on his ass. Let's go. Sadly, with this hand, we did kind of brick. We drew a sword soul hand. So this is the beauty of this deck. The worst case scenario, you end up on a sword soul board that's the worst case scenario for this deck but you know what sword soul boards they're not that crazy sword soul boards are very easily defeated by other decks i i was desperately there trying to draw a, a scale uh with the draw from mo Ye. sadly we did not draw that scale from mo Ye. but that's all good because one know we did draw a beautiful playmat. You can get on www.driftgaming.com. Oh my goodness, look at the amazingness. I do only have like four Remcore playmats left, maybe four more uh, a Warrior Electro mats left. This guy, check it out. Here we get hit with Imperm. And look, this is just a typical board. I did not want to go for Needle Fiber combo because I felt Needle Fiber, like we could lose to one hand trap. I was like, fuck it, let's just do this, get some value, hope to survive next turn. He backs you, boom, just like that. Our, our board was gone. That shit was like, you see that? That's the biggest issue of this deck. It's one you do not draw scales. You just have a sword soul board, and that was not enough against it. Like a, a very good hand of this meta, the sword soul's ass. So we did break there really hard. Woo, what? Look at that arm, bro. Oh, beautiful. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm sure you guys check out your arms in the mirror as well. I also check mine out. Like the average amount a human does, like 17,000 times. So uh, I'm sure you guys do the same. Uh, anyways, yeah, we didn't lose there. Our match did not bring us to glory, but that's okay because it'll bring you guys to glory when you purchase your first drift play mat. It, it is a whole different feeling. It's like the Rolls Royce 
of Yu-Gi-Oh playmats. Let's go. Here we go. Needle fiber. He infirms. I'm like, all right, this fucking hurts us. Actually, this hurts us. But you know what? That's fine. That's fine. We still go and clap some big ass cheeks. Let's go. Here I'm debating what should I pen summon? What should I end on? I know Needle Fiber has an effect that's gonna catch him a little bit off guard here. Uh, we're gonna search the counter trap. We're gonna bring out Lamia. Lamia and the Zephyr Nui will make us a dragster. And then because of the long Yuan ceiling there, it's just gonna be Synchro Summon into a Synchro 8. He Feather Duster or Dark Rulers. I negate that. I bring up Formula Synchron. Get Imperm Dark Rulers. Four cards left. I have Shen Shen if I really wanna go into it, but I also wanna go into a Synchro 8 with the Formula and the long Yuan on his turn. Uh, we had the Divine Strike the Dark Ruler, and now we're gonna see what he does. He goes Asha. This is what I should have done at this point. Literally, so he enters Battle Phase. I should have to say, fuck Dragster. I should have literally go straight to Shen Shen. At this scenario, if I go Shen Shen, he loses the game. Well, there's no answer. There's no answer. That's what I should have done. I went back to it to shuffle that back. I should have gone Shen Shen. I was hoping Dragster would negate it, and then he just Moye summons, and I'm fucked. Like, you see that? This is a big problem uh, sometimes. Like, I could have done better. This is a very bad showing for round one. I'm disappointed in our performance, but it's okay because we're just going to win the next ones. It's all good. It's all good, boys. Bro, easy. Oh, how did I lose? I'm Man. telling you, I didn't have to use it, bro. I didn't have to use it. I didn't have to use it. I had it in my hand, and I'm like, bro, I don't even need this. Oh, my God. <laughs> guys. Damn. Easy, you know what? It happens, guys. It happens. We lost there. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's always round one. We've been getting clapped every round one, and we've been winning every other round after that. This has to stop. Uh, but, you know, it's a good match. He's playing good deck there. It's all good. We'll get our revenge next time. Bro, this whole time, it wasn't even on. So, guys, we just lost, but that's okay, because it's a Wednesday. And on Wednesday, there's a place here where $50 tattoos, so cheap. I got ripped off from my other two. They tried me, like, $500. I'm like, yeah. I walked in. I'm like, hey, guys. See my yeah. I got so ripped off. I know. Five hundred. I I know. I walked in. I'm like, I I walked in. I was like, I was like, hey, I know. Both the same thing. I walked in. I was like, hey, I didn't know anything about tattoos. I got ripped off. I know. I got ripped off. I walked in like I was such a noob. I walked in like, yeah, I didn't know anything about tattoos. And, and then uh, at the end, I'm like, how much? He's like, oh, 500. I'm like, no, it was like, it was a, no, it was 400 something, but like plus tax and 10 was 500. So you didn't investigate the price for four years? No. I'm, I was a noob. But there's a place here with $50 tattoos for small ones. Very cheap, so I don't want to. I don't want to come out with like green stuff coming out of my arms or something. But I'm gonna get pendulum scales on my shoulders, so I'm gonna go see what they have to say, and then the next Wednesday I'm gonna come actually get the tattoo because I have a tournament to win. You should get one right in the middle. It's a sucker. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What should I get? Right in the middle. Sucker. Sucker. No. Oh, after I got ripped off. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get it. You know what? Guess what? I'm gonna get it. What else should I get? I want to get other tattoos. A big L. I lose once and they tell me to get L's. What the heck? <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sosa. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. How old are you? How are you two? Are you three? Are you four? Are you five? Are you 29? Are you 30? 29. Are you 29? Yeah. So are you 29 now? Wait, is it actually your birthday? Yeah. Oh shit! Yo, happy birthday, bro. When? No, I didn't. Yeah, you put a care react. Oh, that was your birthday? I just saw you guys in Montreal. I'm like, that's sick. Yeah, we rented at a. Oh, yeah, I saw my invite got lost in the mail, but okay. That was a few years ago. What? <laughs> yo, yo, this guy's trolling. Yo, 29 or 30? 30. Oh, you old as hell, bro. It's got 20. Oh, he's not, though? A sucker. <laughs> yo, everyone, yo, I'm about to go get a tattoo. What tattoo should I get? Jersey Shore. Jersey Shore. Yo, if I get if I get scales on my shoulders, is that corny? Yeah, that's not corny, bro. That's fire. I think that's pretty fire, right? I think that's pretty insane. I think 
the people you're taking advice from is probably the not, not the best group of people. Okay. Yo, Abdul. Yo, should I get tats right now? What should I get? On your wrist. What about this? Is not a good idea. That's pretty sick. <laughs> this is not a good idea. Okay, sick. Yo, I'm gonna walk in and see what they say. Three minutes left in the round. I'm shit at time scheduling. As you guys know, I didn't post for like five days. So, what we're gonna do now, we're gonna wait for this next round to be up. My next opponent is 0 01, so I'm gonna 2 0 him in five minutes. And then after that, we're gonna get our scale, our, our scale tats after that. And we'll see what we're saying. So stay tuned to the end of the video to check it out. Before our next round starts, I want to let you guys know on the most awesome thing we're doing on Patreon. Moving forward, there's going to be a lesson plan every single week on any deck that you guys want. And every single tier zero patron gets to pick a lesson plan of their own. So if you guys want a lesson plan on Endymion, Magician, Sword Soul Pendulum, Brave Endymion, doesn't matter, Masador, whatever it is. All tier zero patrons starting today get to choose. So go check it out. Currently, we're doing Patreon on Sword Soul DDD. The one before was Master Duel and Demian. Let me know exactly what you want for all tier zero members, and we'll do it for you. Sign up right now on the Patreon down below. Also, signing. Also, make sure that we can do locals every single day, so go check it out. Let's go. Yo, they should sign up on Patreon, right? What? I don't know. They should, no, they should sign up on my Patreon. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, you should sign up. All right, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, bro. I think I told you this already, but your hat's insane. Yeah, Literally 11 out of 10. Uh, you know Farfa has one too? I like Ash Blossom feet. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, I'm facing my boy Jinsuk. He's playing Glad Beast. So like I said, in about 5 minutes, we'll be at the tattoo shop getting a tat. Let's go. Let's go baby, next round. Next round. We got this. I believe in my abilities of pure destruction. Uh, I'm going to face off against my boy here but with Glad Beasts. I gotta go get a tattoo, baby. So we gotta make this fast. I'm gonna let him put up whatever board he wants. I'm gonna clap everything up. He's actually, he's playing Glad Beast, but he's gonna put up an actual legit board. He's gonna eventually, when you guys see it in like a few seconds, Apollosa for three, uh, Hope Harbinger, which stops Apollosa from getting attacked. And this Jackal King, that's like the big fusion monster is like a Jackal King. So it's pretty big board here, but I'm gonna clap this shit up for breakfast. Uh, five negates and all of Apollosa negates are gonna resolve. I bait him to negate the harmonizing so I could resolve pen call. Easy money. I try to bait that I was about to pen summon. Because uh, he thought he'll never use Harbinger again. I go Baxia. I chain block to get rid of the Apoloza. I chain block via the Moye. He negates that. And now the only thing I have left to deal with is the Jackal King fusion monster. So what do I do? I, I use Baxia effect. He's going to instantly negate that because it's going to destroy and clear everything. Celestial specials the Baxia back. So, so he decides to destroy the Baxia. And I use Celestial Magician's effect to bring back the Baxia. Utilize Celestial Magician's effect. I teach that shit on Patreon all the time. It's fucking beautiful. Look at that. Celestial Magician alone in the scale protected this whole thing. Easy. Uh, let's go. It was that easy. And then next in this scenario, I'm like, all right, let's go get some value. Uh, I'm going to, I'm just calculating. I'm like, how could I put up the most amount of interruptions here? I did not normal summon. So I just summon there. I go Oridon. I bring up Cheng Ying. I do a very cool play here. We're going to go Oridon to pop the Cheng Ying and banish that card from the field because it floats. And then Cheng Ying will kill the Harbinger. And then he's going to be left with Shishao and Cheng Ying with no cards in the field. This is going to be game. We basically have to get no, no, he's no follow up. And uh, GG, let's go. I'm trying to get my tap, baby. So we've got to go get this fast. Wrap this shit up, baby. Uh, again, I just, the only reason I want because my Warrior Electro and Playmat. Funny story, actually. These Warrior Electro and Playmats are the only two player Playmats I have. Pretty funny. Anyways, also, if you're a lolly lover, like my friend Jinsuk here, he's a lolly connoisseur, you could get yourself a Dragon Court, man. Uh, here, he bricks hard. I'm like, all right, he called by the Taiye or whatever that was. I'm like, all right, we're going we're to win this game now. It's over. It's game over. We're going to summon this out. We're going to bring out Shishao. Uh, he attempts to negate it, but I chain block the Shishao with the draw of Moye. And uh, he opts not to negate the draw, which is a good play because he negates the Long Yuan. And then that's exactly what the Sorcerer stuff do. do. Sorcerer just baits the interruptions. Now I go Needle Fiber to win. That's literally exactly what it does. Yazi popped that, bring on Taiye. That's exactly what the Sorcerer engine does. It stops the interruptions of my opponent. That way I could actually summon up my main play to win this shit. Exactly what we do. Pendulum, Melhor, deck. Dakor or Jadui. Let's go. Pen best deck. Yo fam, what what tattoo should I get? Pendulum scales. <laughs> Let's go. Solid match there. Now time to go check out the tattoo shop. Let's go. All right, guys, we're going there right now. It says fifty dollars tattoos. The tattoo is going to change colors. <laughs> 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 I'm telling you, man. So Jinsuk and Sosar are saying it's gonna be super bootleg. 
the thing about tattoos where you guys live, it's about fifty dollars. So they say it's super bootleg. We're gonna walk in and see. I think it might be a little sketch as well, but they say fifty dollars every Wednesday for small tattoos. And you know what, guys? If it's legit, I need to get a tattoo every fucking week. So if you guys want to support the tattoo addiction of pencil tattoos, <laughs> buy a playmat right now, bro. Buy a playmat right now, boys. For every two playmats bought, I'm gonna get a pendulum tattoo. Let's go. Yeah, we're going. Hi guys, we just came back from the tattoo shop. They're fully booked, but the place is legit. It's actually really sick. Very nice lady to work there. We're gonna come back next Wednesday and get it. They recommended that we come early in the day, uh, like three o'clock. What the heck? I don't even wake up at that time, but whatever. I'll wake up early to get this. They said about an inch and a half. So basically about Jinsuk's penis size. Is it is it corny as fuck to get scales on my shoulders? I don't even know where we're going. But yeah, boys and girls, Wednesday. We're going, we're getting tatted tats, pen tats. Let me know in the comments what tats I should get. Let's go. Confirm, we're gonna get a tattoo next Wednesday. We got food, some sick ter ter beef teriyaki, excited to eat it. Before we eat that, I'm gonna face my boy Mark for the next round. Let's go. Let's go, baby. We're X1. I don't know what it is. Every single time we lose the round one, we end up winning the next five. So we're gonna do the same thing here. You already know what it is. There's no option for defeat here. Holy shit, kind of crooked mats, but it's okay. Because one know what's not crooked, the beautifulness of pendulums. Let's go. Because pendulums are gonna destroy everything in his path. I know it. And also, uh, guess what, guys? Guess what? Next time, next next video, next vlog, guys, we're br br bringing out. I know I said earlier in the video to guess, well, I'm gonna ruin the, the surprise now. Fast forward se seven seconds if you don't wanna hear the surprise. We're playing Brave Souls at Lich Cybers in Friday, on Friday. I'm hella excited. I think the deck's insane. Uh, it's definitely the best non pendulum deck on the planet. Uh, it's just so damn good uh, with 20 hand traps. You guys are going to see 60 card deck. Fucking beautiful. I'll, I'm going to go 17 and 0 on Friday. It's actually Friday as we speak as I'm editing this. And uh, yeah, so you guys are going to be watching this on Friday. And I'll be going to Friday Locals tonight at the end of after this video is posted. Literally clapping up everyone on my path. Let's go, baby. I'm telling you guys vlogs every fucking day, bro. Every day. Every day. I'll be honest with you guys. I'm hella hungover right now. I had a pretty wild night last night. I uh, got home very late, super drunk. Guess I don't condone. I'm never drinking again until tomorrow. And uh, guess what? I don't care. There's no excuse. I'm gonna still put up videos for you guys. I'm gonna still clap everyone up at locals when I wake up. Being hungover is no excuse. I don't care if my arm falls off. I don't care if my leg breaks, baby. Every day, there's gonna be a vlog on the channel. Every day, I'm gonna be at locals clapping people up no matter what. No excuses. No excuses, just victories. Let's go, baby. Here, we're going into game number two. We lost the game one there. We lost the game one, so we gotta pull out the, the crazy comeback. We gotta pull out the crazy comeback, and we're gonna do such. We summon Moye, the token collectors. I'm like, oh God, no, but that's all right because we still got Lamia. This is the beauty of this deck. Got, oh my God, pen call Lamia. Holy shit, beautifulness. So here, we're going to pen summon. I opt not to go for uh, Lamia. Uh, right away could have probably should have but i also don't want to lose a nib so what i'm going to do here is set up bear in the floor <clears throat> i set up bear in the floor and then i don't know i go she shall oh i think i know what happened i just recognized that he did not have um he did not have a nibiru uh i just did a good like read that he did not have it and even if he did uh yeah we're, we're, we're lit anyways we go she shall here to ah we put up dragite and i'm like hmm, i'm just gonna set to i'm gonna set up a big board here uh because total collector would have stopped Oridon. he goes regeki to gamma i negate that he's up with three cards in hand i have blackout and she and, and blackout and, and uh she shall uh there's no way we could lose here uh he summons this specials like griffin i'm gonna pop two and that's just game he's one card left in hand passes uh at this point i recognize that our extra deck is pretty fucking ass um <laughs> but that's all right puts up gamma driver i pendulum look at all this pendulum summon i just did and i literally have no card in my extra deck to summon my extra deck's amazing but one thing is missing is for something for harmonizing i need like a synchro eight even a fuck like anything even an omega dude like literally just any random synchro eight just, just to make a harmo in situations like this so i just go into apple for four uh attack for 32 pass the turn uh i go search here i'm also i was out of sword soul for top for a thing so i i uh, scale i i set that he was contract it's gonna get him some good follow-up uh, but it's fine because <clears throat> it's still not gonna be enough for him uh he's trying to stop me from playing the following turn uh one contract will not get him anywhere if it was contract kepler search the other contract this will not be able to get him uh, a combo he goes thomas which is a good player get himself some follow-up he's gonna scale this he's gonna pendulum summon that and then uh pop that with the orthros he drew a, a dead card like a hand trap or something 
which obviously can do nothing versus Apo. We just pencil summon Baron and attack the game. So now we're gonna go to game number three. Let's go, baby. I'm fucking hyped. Cool plays like that. You guys can check out on the Patreon. One thing I you can't check on the Patreon is fucking shitty fucking extra deck. Guys, for everyone who's playing this list, who saw my list, throw in a random synchro. I think I was playing Omega for a while. Throw in like a Boral Savage Dragon. Doesn't matter what it is. Just, just play some synchro eight. Any synchro eight just for harmonizing. Because we had Savage Dragon in there. That shit was game way earlier. So here we're gonna go to game number three. We are uh yeah, I'm siding in 15 cards. I'm like, I draw, I draw, I draw one, and he puts up combo. I win. He ends up bricking like crazy, but he has a fuck ton of hand traps. I brick like crazy, but I drew all my board breakers. So I'm like, fuck. He draws me. I'm like, fuck. I didn't brick like crazy. Like pen call would have been fine. Uh, and then he also ashes that. I'm like, fuck, dude. Like, what could I do? Both my plays were gone there. And then, like, you see that with Droll? We didn't even brick, dude. We had dub but double Mystic Mind, but we lost the Droll. Like, Droll killed pen call, and then. Ash on the Ecclesia stopped our turn because of Droll especially. We could have kept going with Pen Call, but Droll destroyed us. So sadly, uh, we didn't have hand traps going second. We have Mystic Mind, two double Mystic Minds in our hand. Sadly, he couldn't put anything up. That's GG. We ended up losing this one. Very disappointing that we lost. But you know what? A little gutted, but it doesn't matter because Pen Best deck and we got big ass biceps. So at the end of the day, it's all good, baby. Life is good. Life is good. Uh, it's all good, baby. Let's go. Hey guys, not our day today. Droll just destroyed us. And he break with the sad. We had Mystic Mind. We would have stopped him for a turn. Uh, a little unfortunate, but you know what? That's Yu-Gi-Oh. We're still gonna play out the last round here. Uh, it, it's all good. A little, little gutted here that we lost, but it happens. We'll win the next one. Got some amazing beef teriyaki. Gotta fill the biceps with protein. Let's go. That was some of the best we ever had. Holy shit, that hit the spot. I'm gonna go back and thank them, bro. That's how good that... I'm gonna go all the way back and thank them. That was delicious. Are you talking about drugs? No. That's what he's talking about mattresses. Mattress. You're playing out. Five rounds. Let's go, baby. I'm a win. I'm a win. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Round number four. We are ready. Uh, we're gonna face my boy yo he's playing the, the craziest deck uh i actually cannot believe what happened you guys are about to witness the, the most fucking insane shit of all time to this fucking day i oh my i'm still salty this happened like the craziest shit ever anyways before that crazy shit happened you should watch this greatness to unfold first we're gonna go moye the beauty of this deck bro like you could have hand trapped me at any time we just pen summon and we'll be all right sadly we are playing literally just this is sword soul cards like we have all sword soul cards i'm like bro Let's, we gotta do better than this. So we go Ordon. Uh, we're gonna be lit though. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine because Pen Best deck. You already know what it is. We go Yazi. Uh, I pop the Yazi, bring on Taye. I summon this. Uh, I give him opportunity to use a hand trap. I'm trying to bait him into using a hand trap. I want him to use a hand trap. Uh, I'm just trying to get a bunch of value in my hand right here. This is what I'm doing. I'm just adding cards to my hand uh, to be able to like have a beautiful pendulum summon. I have Baxi available to make a dragster with a token because I can special Ecclesia and pop the Oracle of Zephyr, which is huge. I pendulum of these. I get some huge value. I'm going to put that into Baron to uh, put that into Baron to floor. Uh, I'm going to put this again. I'm just trying to think of most negates. Like Dragite, uh, Dragster, I have a water and grave. And then I add, that, add at the end phase. Uh, look, and then boom, GG. He's playing Drytron, but I mean, I'm a big ass board, so it doesn't like he, he's not going to be able to do much. Uh, like, look at this massive misplay. I negate Cyber Emergency. Fucking idiot, bro. I completely forgot about Cyber Emergency. The fact that you he's playing Cyber Dragon, so he just discard and add it back. Uh, he does not discard a Drytron telling me his hand is ass. The second I realized he had no Drytrons in hand, I negated the Nova because he would have discarded the Drytron off, off of Emergency. So it was a good telltale sign right there that uh, he had no actual names in hand. So I had to negate everything moving forward. And uh, that is that's game. Uh, there's nothing could have been done because uh, Pen Best Deck. I already know what it is. Let's go. So now we're going to go on to game number two. And this is where the most wild shit of all time will happen. Uh, bro, if you made all through this video, just watch this right now. It's about to be insane. Like, literally, sub smash the subscribe button right now. Because what you're about to witness is gonna fucking make you want to actually delete YouTube. It's gonna make you want to delete all your social medias and never play Yu-Gi-Oh again. Because I I debated it after this shit was pulled out on me. I can't. I, to this day, I'm like, what the heck? Anyways, uh, look at this. Look at this now. Okay, so he's gonna go curious. He's playing a really cool combo here, where uh, you know, he's able to search out Benten, fuel his graveyard. Like, very cool combo here in Drytron. Not no boring ass drag trying to play a very cool version and now no, look at this shit look at this shit look at this shit look at this shit i can't believe this bro i literally got ftk my fucking dry trying look at this shit I, I i can't fucking believe it on a 50 52 holy shit look he brings out arcana the world he brings out arcana the world are you kidding me what the fuck is arcana the world bro what
Are you kidding me? <laughs> Thank you for giving him some subject. <laughs> All right, Ray's gonna flip it for me. So, he so heads. Uh, yeah, heads, please. Oh, <laughs> Don't skip. I wanna. <laughs> Okay. Drop or drop? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so pass and face should be these two, and then. Uh, Bro, he skips this one, and then. I hope he doesn't even kill you. Do it again. Do it again. <laughs> and then that's side cards are going against that's the world. Plus three. Oh, so that's five. Plus eight. Yo, so you actually got FTK. You didn't get a turn. <laughs> that's great. Are you proud? Yeah, I wouldn't play it. You leave your house to go to locals, and you're like, I'm gonna have a great time today, and you decide to play this? I've played like eight games, I haven't got this until now. You had, <laughs> Please tell me this is you had to be the example. This is the, this is the last time I'm playing without fucking hand traps. This could have been a fucking impermanence. Bro, you got fucking FDK. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What? Are you guys watching this? He flipped a coin with Arcana of the World. The card says, heads, skip your opponent's turn. Why is there a card to Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's just skip your opponent's turn! What? And it was literally a 50-50. If he misses, I was good. He didn't have the field spell. And he fucking called it right. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, bro. I'm, I'm sick to my stomach. Now, all, bro, if we don't draw pendulum cards here and just all sorts of cards again, I'm be so mad. Guess what? I'm mad! We drew all sorts of cards! What the heck? We need to draw here badly. I set up Baron before the thing in case he plays Nibiru. I literally she shout chain link two, Moye chain link one, because I cannot allow Moye to be Ash. I need this fucking draw. And I drew all sorts of cards. Like, you could see me molding there. I'm like, what the heck? What the heck? What the heck? All sorts. And then I got fucking lava golem. Oh my god, I fucking hate this. Bruh. 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 Are you watching this? Oh my god. I hate Yu Gi Oh! But I also love you, Gio, and I love you guys. I've had finer days. Very disappointing. The real champions get back up. Real champions realize maybe you're not having the best day for you, Gio. But guess what? We got a big ass bicep, so it's all good. It's all good, and we're gonna win our next one. Let's go. Yo, my record is about to go from second to fucking thirtieth after that pathetic performance today. But it's all good. Are you ready? Maybe open with someone so I might win again. I will open three hand traps, pen call, and emergence. Okay, let's see. All right, let's go. Let's go, baby. Hey, guys. This is my friend's hand. You guys want to see this? So he has this card. It's good, right? This card, I guess, pretty good. Rich. Yeah, it's really good. Look at this. What the fuck is this guy doing? This is literally my most humiliating performance at the locals in my life. But I'm not the type of guy to not show the L's. You gotta take the dubs with the L's. We go 5-0 in the last vlog, and we're fucking X3 right now on round 5. That's fucking insane. Horrible performance, but am I a quitter? Nah. I'm not gonna just show you guys the wins. I'm gonna show you guys the L's as well. This is what a real chance. I'm embracing them. Uh, I will never lose again. And this hurts that I'm losing. You know, it hurts that I lost three times and I won once. That, that's pathetic. I'm furious about it. So I'm going to take it out on this DD player. My guy, Cameron. That's my, my boy. I'm going to clear this whole DD board for breakfast. I'm going to eat this board up literally for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Uh, but it's all good. It's all good. I chain block here with multiple chain blocks to go back. So you have to shuffle all that shit back. See you later. See you later. All that shit's gone. Next, I'm going to go emergence. I'm going to summon a uh, Baron ASAP. Baron, pop that chain. Negate with Baron. At this point, I'm like, I. Right, that's all good. That's all good. Wonder why it's all good, baby? Because now we have Baxi effect is special. We have like, bro, we are lit. This is the beauty of Ecclesia, bro. Being just a random tuner in the graveyard to bring out. We're gonna pop, uh, we pop our, our own uh, card, uh, Baxia to bring that out. So we can go Ordon, or uh, Ordon Chengying, banish his card in field so it doesn't uh, float and kill him. OTK through the DD board. We're insane. OTK through the DD board. Pendulum, best deck, despite being X3. <laughs> it's all good bro like of course we're sad that we're x3 but you know what look at like uh, you guys know how it is some days you'll be 5-0 some days you'll be oh oh some days you're xo some days you're ox it's whatever it's Yu-Gi-Oh. sometimes you get a little unlucky but that's all right because i'm gonna take this energy and next time friday night tonight and win and you know what i was hungover going into this video no i'm not hungover the Yu-Gi-Oh saved the hungover the hangover is officially gone let's go i'm telling you guys it's all good 
all you need baby in life is a positive mental attitude and that will fix whatever problems you have going on in your head whatever problems you have going on in your life literally my headache was gone i was kind of sad earlier in the day because of my headache i was hungover that's gone now the power of pendulums the power of positivity i love you guys my cat my, my, my i won this game I, i've mystic mind you're about to witness it and mystic mind carried me to victory uh anyways i'm gonna have to stop the video here because we name a better combo than, than trip gaming and a dead phone my phone ran out of batteries randomly abruptly so we're gonna end it you're gonna see the mystic mine and i go for my combo after i wait for three turns and i just go missing my pass i wait for four turns i set up full combo baron and she shall clear all this shit and win uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the video there's gonna be another vlog tomorrow pendulum best deck uh tomorrow like i said we're playing the most beautiful deck of, of all time let's go i love you guys pen best deck peace